I don't know what you're fucking latched onto in your brain, what stray hairs have fucking commingled and tangled in your brain to make you think you've really figured some sort of thing out. But this is not unusual for you. It's like almost every fight I can pretty much guarantee you will find something that you can like ma let's, manipulate. Let's let's ask Travis into tonight. If you yes, told why don't we him. invite Travis into our fucked up, broken ass, three fucking wheeled truck of a marriage? Just afraid that the truth will come out. What truth? That you lied. What are you fucking talking about? I didn't fucking even have a, a fucking thing to lie about. What are you fucking talking about? Every fucking fight, there's a new thing that you've convinced yourself no, is a lie. I said to you, you Amber, tell Travis what you just did. Did you just fucking, <laughs> did you punch me in the fucking jaw? Did you fucking kick? Did you? Mm -hmm. Did you? And you wouldn't say a fucking reason. I don't know what oh, you're so talking I about. Lie. Never fucking, I see the never lie. fucking happened. I see the lie. You really should run with this. In fact, maybe you and Travis can like, you know, do a tell all about what a, hey, what, you stop. know, an investigative stop study. Stop with the attitude, right? Stop with the attitude. Sorry. Whatever you think happened with Trotty, this it wasn't no. a conversation. Listen, we I was not high. I'm not going you to. You lied, your asshole. You were fucking full of shit. What lied? lied? When? Hmm? What conversation did I have with Travis? I have a big, big investigative study you've done. I'm not sitting here no, and fighting with you about the, with the you. fight that After we had last night. After you fucking got physically violent with me, I texted Travis. I said, come up here because I, I didn't want anything to happen. I mean, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's coming well, save me. No, go ahead, continue. You, 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 Travis, to the rescue. No, that, no, that was the last one. You can go, uh, you go. That was the last insult. You called me a liar, and yet, yeah. I watched you lie. You, it's right there. There's no what. You still haven't told me what lie it is. We'll talk but yet, to, every single fucking time. We'll you know you Chav. do this every single fucking time. We'll talk time. to Chav. I'm not fucking talking to nobody. No, fuck that. Fucking, you go fucking jerk. Go jerk him off. I don't care. It's you every single time. You latch onto some sort of thing. When I already told you, I don't know what you're fucking talking about. You don't even know what you're talking about. You still haven't even told me what it is. But run with it. You I have told you what it is. No, you haven't. The way Amber here is gaslighting Johnny, telling him he's crazy, making something up. He does this every fight. He's delusional. She doesn't know what he's talking about. He doesn't even know what he's talking about. He told her, no, I wasn't high. And just the way that she's doing it indicates to me this is something she may have often done to Johnny. She also tried to use this exact argument in the trial that oftentimes he was high. Her recollection and Johnny's recollection are always very different because he either wasn't taking his meds or he was in the throes of his addiction or he's just old. She tried to pose him and a lot of her testimony as a liar or literally not even remembering or knowing exactly what happened. They wouldn't know what he was talking about on the phone and she talked about this a lot during the trial. So I wanted to point this out here because this is her doing it to Johnny Depp in real time. This is also something that abusers do. They gaslight them essentially and try to make them think they're the crazy one, not themselves. They're not the crazy one. You are the crazy one. So this is a very extreme level of gaslighting using somebody's mental illnesses, their use of medication, their addiction, or just their age, anything. This is an extreme level of gaslighting to try to make Make someone basically lose a sense of their reality or feel like unsure about themselves and their recollection or their memory. I have told you what it is. No, you haven't. I said to Travis, I said, no, I said to you, tell Travis what just happened. You, oh, you told me to do it. You yeah. told me to. You said, go do that. I said, no, tell, tell him what just happened. And I lied. And that you punched me in the You're fucking right. thing and you, you figured in the face. Out. And you said, no, fuck it. No, I didn't. What the fuck are you talking about? And I, I watched you lie. You. And then I, I didn't punch you, and by the way. You... I'm sorry that I didn't uh, you, uh, uh, hit you me. across the face in a proper slap, but I was hitting you. It was not punching you. 